What are the three most important things in real estate? Location, location, and location, of course. I'm gonna show you the neighborhood that niche.com says is not just the best neighborhood in Louisville, yes, Louisville, but the entire state of Kentucky. <laughs> I'm Neil Cox. I'm with Judah Real Estate Group here in Louisville, Kentucky. On the Living in Louisville, Kentucky channel, we've been putting out videos all about our city, pronounced Louisville. Get it right. It's not Louisville. It's not Louisville. We say Louisville. Uh, we're putting out new videos each week. If you want to see these when they come out, go ahead and subscribe. Um, even more importantly, though, click the little bell. You'll get a notification when a new video comes out. Very important. But if you're one of those folks that's actually thinking of making a move here to Louisville, Kentucky, you're going to have to go one step further. You're going to get out your phone. You're going to email, text, call, sound the bugle, because we're going to get off to the races to help you make your move to Louisville. Of course, there's a lot of fantastic communities around the city, and I get asked a lot, you know, what's the best place to live in Louisville? And there is a little bit of argument around that, but if you go to niche.com right now, it's a great neighborhood site, and you type in best neighborhood in Louisville, Kentucky, it's gonna come up with a little suburb called Anchorage. And Anchorage is a really cool spot that people absolutely love. It is one of those home rule class cities that we've talked about in other videos that they're kind of a, a city within a city. It has a mayor, it has a city council, it has its own budget, it has its own police force, all separate from the city of Louisville. Speaking of the cops, a little tip for when you're in town, obey the speed limit in Anchorage. Thank me later. The one knock against Anchorage on niche.com is the diversity of the residents there. Anchorage has very few rental properties. Um, the median home value is a little bit more than $700,000, um, a starter home in some places, but for that much here in Louisville, you're going to have yourself a pretty spectacular place. Um, Anchorage is popula populated by homeowning folks that are doing pretty well financially. Uh, people tend to stay in their homes a long time. Um, famous Louisvillians sometimes end up living in Anchorage, along with some other areas, but that's... Uh, that's definitely a popular one. It actually has its own school district. Uh, it only goes to eighth grade though. So Anchorage students filter out into various public and private high schools for their high school career. Uh, there are a couple popular restaurants in Anchorage. Um, why don't we look at them? Why don't we see them? Let's go to Anchorage. Come on. Whew. That was crazy. Anchorage Public School, ranked as the best school and school district in Kentucky on niche.com. Um, do your own research, of course, but I really think it's everything that you would want in a public school. I'm gonna go to a different high school, of course, but there's a, a lot of good options, especially out towards the East End in Louisville, but all around, um, you'll find yourself at a great place. It's beautiful, it's well-kept, it's, it's in a very scenic area. Hard to beat. Let's look around a little bit more. One of the coolest things about the whole city of Anchorage is that it's got mature trees everywhere. A lot of really cool shaded areas. And one of my favorite things, because I get hot really easily, because of the canopy and its uh, location, it is often several degrees cooler in Anchorage than it is in downtown Louisville. Anchorage has a history that's well connected with the railroad and it was the lines around here that allowed it to become a thriving area. Um, you've got a little bit of a downtown area where you've got the police department right there. It's own police. Remember those speed limit signs? And then just over here you've got one of the few 
uh, restaurants that are right in Anchorage. This is the Village Anchor. It's a really popular spot. And then you've even got your own craft brewery. 1020 Craft Brewery right here in Anchorage. Popular spot. Um, you you also have your own uh, post office. It's right behind me. And uh, it's a really cool spot. The cops were just checking me out right outside the station. Um, it's just a really cool community. You know, you can you can do whatever you want and, and not leave, or you can leave. It's beautiful. Walking trails, festivities, all right here. Um, the famous landmark is the anchor inside the railroad. It's like a tire rim or something. The railroad and that anchor named from the founder of Anchorage are big symbols here. And you've even got some businesses like the little paint and sip area. And there's some other businesses right around here too. Let's go see some of the homes typical of the area and then we will head back to the office. So that's Anchorage. Um, of course, any place is going to have its pluses and minuses, but do your own research. I think if you investigate crime data online that you'll get a really good feeling about Anchorage. Uh, of course, if you have to commute to downtown or somewhere like that within the city, it might not be the most convenient place to live. Um, but it's really not that far from the whole interstate system. so. Nowhere in Louisville it is isolated and difficult to get to. Um, the history of the, the whole community is my favorite part. Um, the entire county, Jefferson County, has just over 220 registered places uh, on the historical registry. 35 of those 220 are in Anchorage. It's got lots and lots of history. It's just a really cool spot. Um, Isaac W. Bernheim, who is the namesake of Bernheim Forest, which is to the south, had a very important role in the history of Anchorage. Trivia question, uh, how did he influence Anchorage and its growth? Comment below. Uh, what neighborhood will I feature next? Uh, well, the goal here on the Living in Louisville channel is to be informative. So let us know what you'd like to see. Uh, I'm going to be highlighting all kinds of neighborhoods. If there's one that you're interested in and would like to see, leave a comment. We'll do it. Uh, of course, make sure to subscribe below and click the bell to get notified when we post a new video. And as always, if you're one of the many people that are out there thinking of making a move to Louisville, email us, call us, text us, sound the bugle, off to the races to help make your move to Louisville, Kentucky a great one. Now, I am going to go enjoy a hot round. What is a hot round? <laughs>